I'm doing something quite a bit different than what I usually do. I'm going to church. <laughs> um, my grandmother and grandfather are always, you know, how grandparents do. They want you to go to church and stuff. And Well, I usually just, they gave up on me a long time ago. But it's Mother's Day, so happy Mother's Day to all my fellow mothers out there. And for you single dads, happy Mommy's Day to you too. Because sometimes daddies are mommy too. So, happy Mother's Day to you guys too. And for my grandmother, it's Mother's Day gift, I'm going to church. So, see you guys there if I feel in the church. <laughs> So, done with church, got a rose for being a mommy, Alyssa got a rose because she's Alyssa, um, now I guess we're getting ready to take pictures, I don't know, um, I was a bit late, that's okay, I made it they sing first anyway, so I'm gonna go do the picture thing with everybody. Really don't know what's going on now. I'll let you know when I figure it out. Hope you guys have had a great Mother's Day. To all you mommies out there and daddies. Hi! Well, this is being called from down at now. Somebody said something about. Well, my our Uncle Lloyd calls her a little bit, and all we heard was maybe a little bit. And she said, "Huh?" <laughs> Today's been a bit of a weird day. Um, I've had an EMS attack in two years. Yeah. However, today, yay! Mother Nature said, "Happy Mother's Day." There's an MS episode for you. I'll explain later. Getting ready for summer. Had to completely clean out the water. And some people are coming tomorrow to put in a new liner. That way we can open up the pool. Yay! I was getting ready to start editing my vlog for Mother's Day. However, I just watched a few videos and decided this would probably be more important. The reason this video I believe is more important is because there's a mother this year who won't be celebrating with her son anymore. His name was Gabriel Taye, eight years old, third grade, just like Alyssa will be, who hung himself. Two days prior to that, he was bullied so viciously that he was left unconscious in the boys' restroom while 18 students just stepped over him like he wasn't there. Yeah, they would stop, look at him, kind of point or nudge him with their feet and just walk away. As a mother, and to any other parent watching, you know, bullying happens. But, when do we step in and say, okay, this is enough. We can't read our kids' minds. This mom did not know a thing about any of this. The school said that he fainted. Link in the description to the video that proves otherwise, but I will warn you, it's heartbreaking. It takes like four and a half minutes before an administrator to happen to walk by and find him when there's, you'll know, see a teacher or a coach or somebody in the gym right there who even opens the door at one point and doesn't see him. Oh, anybody 
any of those 18 students could have walked right there and said, Hey, Gabriel or this little boy is laying right there in the bathroom. Alyssa has said that she's been bullied before. And as a mom, you don't want to think about somebody being mean to your kid. So, I usually brush it off as, oh, it's, you know, you're okay, you know, it's okay. But when she was in first grade, kindergarten or first grade, I want to say, there was a little boy that was absolutely torturing her. I, after she told me about it, went in and talked to the principal. And um, it was taken care of. Uh, apparently, this little boy had been doing it to many people. But then I find out, after it was taken care of, that the teacher set them side by side. Why? You know? Do we need teachers that care? Not that are just there for the paycheck, that care, that watch the kids. I'm just talking, as they said. You know, somebody that worked there said that the teachers seem more, more worried about each other than about the kids because they take them to recess and they sit there and talk and they're watching the kids and at lunchtime when they're eating and not paying attention. Something has to happen because last video I was talking about the blue wheel, white wheel, wake me up before 20 challenges. And now I'm talking about Gabriel Taillé who's gone. For what? You know? I cannot fathom what his mother is dealing with right now. Alyssa is my world. Oh god, and just to... Just to think about what she's going through and you know she had to be the one to find him. Oh my god. I couldn't imagine it. They would probably have to put me right beside her. I don't think I could live through that. Yesterday, um, my aunt stole my child. Okay, she didn't really steal her. However, she did go a stale night with Alex and Kai and my aunt. So now I'm going to do my best to go and get her. However, I don't know how well that's going to go. Let's go find out though, shall we? <laughs> First, I am going to show you what I have been working on today. You see, my grandparents have this like wooden swing, right? And my grandfather sanded it down. And I saw my grandma starting to paint on it, and I wasn't going to have that, you know. She don't need to be doing that stuff. So, that's what I've done today. Painted that sucker. Hey, family. So, today, I have Makai, Alyssa, and Miss Kendra here. Now, today, I have them sitting here at this table because we're doing Bean Boozled. 2.0 because there are two new flavors. Two. And they are. Hold on. Okay. Strawberry, Strawberry banana, banana smoothie, smoothie or, or dead fish. And. Dead fish. Coconut. Spoiled milk. They are going like to be bananas. doing this. I like bananas, but no. Let's see well. how it goes. <laughs> okay, open her up. Get that oh, out. That means I got glass. That's that's cool. Yep. Glass? <laughs> Last. <laughs> you said you get glass. Are we all doing the same flavor? Like she spins one and we get all get one? Yeah. Okay. And then I'll oh. spin one and we all get okay. Ready? Okay. Look, I spin flip it. And it is Huh. Juicy pear or booger? Ooh. Oh, is it this one? The speckled green one? Mm-hmm. Oh, I don't trust this one. I want this one. <laughs> I'm going to get it either way. I'm gonna... Ooh, this one. 
Yeah. Okay. Sugar. Ready, guys? Oh, yeah. You might want to open your pops. Yeah. Let's just... Let's open the soda, though. Just maybe. Just a little bit. Yep. Ready? One. I'm, ta I'm taking one bite. Two. No, put the whole thing around. No. I'm, I'm little. Go. Yes. It's still disgusting. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's better than Mark. I mean, yeah, it's better than Mark. Nope. It's nasty, but I'll take it. Get it out. There oh, you God, go. your breath. <laughs> now. I got a good one. I told you I didn't choose that. Mmm. Oh, yes. Your turn. Don't leave mine. this up to me. <laughs> Y'all die, it's not my fault. That's a good one. Oh no. Nope, no. Or boiled milk. Everybody, <gasps> sit down. It's a pure, pure white one. I don't trust this. I'm mm -hmm. choking this. Either way. Either All right, way. Ready? Either way. I, I still have booger in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Alyssa. What did I tell you about eating boogers? All right, ready? Mm -hmm. One. one. Hold on. Oh. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm back. I'm back. One. Two, go. What'd you get? What'd you get, Alyssa? Was it coconutty? Or milky? Spoiled milk. Spoiled milk. That's not. How's that? All right, what'd you have? Same thing. Spoiled yep. milk? Yep. Oh. If it was coconut, I wouldn't like it. Okay, so we're having to refill the drinks. Alyssa switched to some water, and she's still with her Dr. Pepper. So, now, this right here, this spoiled milk stuff, is, it does not make me want to like milk. Well, thank God I don't drink milk, right? Yeah, I don't drink milk at all. Oh, no. What it's is it? either caramel corn or mochi. Great! That was that. <laughs> is it that one? Um... No, it's not. I think. So, get ready to go get the girls from their dad's house. They went and stayed there for a couple of days, and since then, I've been all busy with other things. We're doing the Bean Boozled Challenge until my batteries died. You didn't miss much. We didn't do it much longer because then I had to give Makai some Pepto Bismol because he was starting to throw up. Yeah. It got real. <laughs> but let's go get the girls. They're going to be staying here for a few days. Of course, Alyssa lives here. She's always here. But Kendra's staying with us for a few days. You know what I mean. And now I'm back. It's actually tonight. We got the girls. And instead of Kendra coming here tonight, Kendra went to a friend's house who was having a summer party. And I ended up here. Nothing new. He's always here. I can't get rid of him. What do you do? Kind of, kind of grows on you after a while, though. You know. <laughs> but I got him. And of course, right behind him. She doesn't talk here. much. Oh, I'm sorry. She's not here. I don't know what she's saying. Alyssa's gone. Huh? You're just, You're just seeing stuff. I'm seeing things. I'm hallucinating. I don't know. What do you do? But I'm going to get in this here that we can get this up. Uh, I'll explain the whole thing in my next video about mom's emergency surgery and Kendra's mom's surgery. Hope you're having an amazing day, but if not, remember in time this too shall pass. Please like this video, subscribe if you haven't already, join the family. You did it wrong, it's join the family! <laughs> if you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. <laughs> like this video, it really helps. Share this video if you really like it, and I'll see you guys next time.